This is so exciting. This has to be test number three, I think. I don't like talking to the camera. I don't like talking to the camera. Okay, here we go again. This is me forcing myself to talk to the camera. Every time I place myself in front of a camera and tell myself that I'm going to start a YouTube channel, I don't. And I'm sick of that. I'm not gonna really question myself, why should I or why should I not do it? I'm sure that I have a lot of things to say. My language is this medium. My language is audiovisual content, editing. If I keep everything in my hard drive, it will rot. And all I can wish for and hope for is for people to learn from it, grow from it, and hopefully connect with it. I'm clearly just starting with this. I'm using my phone. Terrible idea. As a filmmaker, I know that I should not be doing this. I just want to touch base on what this YouTube channel is going to look like. And that is insight to lessons. Give me one second. Wait, we're back. Lessons that I've had over the years that I've been documenting in my journals full of personal experiences, letters, lessons, and things that I know can help other people, which is why I started doing my dot MOVs. This is not a blog. This is an MOV. Basically, a dot MOV is a short video with a message or a lesson inspired from my journal prompts, my own voice, and I share it because I have faith that it can help others. These are reflections of things. Oh my God, I'm reflecting the light of my phone on my glasses. Everything is going imperfectly perfect. I'm gonna look back on this video and laugh so much at every single mistake that I'm doing right now. This was my first one, second one, third one, which I actually have little like journal prompts of when I was 15 and going through a very difficult situation. So that was very interesting. Combining my 15 year old self and my, I think it was 20 year old self at the time. This one right here was the last one. I finished it today. This one was for sure the most, the most, <laughs> the most bittersweet journal I've ever written. I just got this one today. This is my fifth journal. I've never had a colored journal, which is ironic because I love colors. So that's what this channel will be all about. It will be a lot of introspection, a lot of questions, a lot of mistakes, but most importantly, there will be a lot of growth. I want to document my own personal growth and share it with you. Hopefully you learn from mine.